appreciate it. Yes. Thank you no. very much. Yeah, no problem, sir. Thank you. It's my pleasure. Vietnam veteran Barry Hutchinson has his purple heart and dog tags back where they belong, thanks to another veteran who couldn't leave them behind. Barry, who served in Vietnam 50 years ago, was in the process of moving when a box fell out of his truck. Jason Murphy, who served in Iraq, Afghanistan, and Pakistan, spotted the box on the side of the road in Wakefield. As soon as I opened up the uh, purple heart box and actually seen that or it was the purple heart in there, and I opened up the uh, wooden box. There was a set of dog tags in there. He spent a month trying to trace the military honors before enlisting help from the organization Purple Hearts Reunited, the founder and active duty National Guardsman himself. Uh, the dog tags. That's the key element to this. That's yeah. how we were able to find you. This return is very special to me. My father was a Vietnam veteran, so it's great to honor uh, heroes like Mr. Hutchinson. Well, the Lord had his hand in it and everything just sort of came together and uh, I'm really pleased. Barry earned his Purple Heart when he was wounded by a grenade while serving in the Special yeah, Forces are... in Vietnam. Jason is now medically retired from the Army as he fights another battle, a brain tumor. He says this reunion does his heart good. It feels amazing to be able to actually finally meet Barry and to be able to hand over his Purple Heart to him and hand over his uh, dog tags and his memories back to him. I really want to thank you again. I can't, <laughs> can't tell you how much it's, I appreciate it's, it's, it. It's my pleasure, sir. Yeah. In Wakefield, Gene Mackin, WMUR News 9.